hi everyone my name is shazia welcome back to my channel i hope you guys are doing great um today in this video i'm going to talk about a very interesting topic uh it's about the scam messages or scam calls so people who are new in canada will be surprised uh of, you know uh, the number of call or messages that you will receive from these um scammers these are the scam messages and they claim uh they will they will claim that there's money pending there's something that you need to claim and uh, someone is transferring your money and um, or like there's a package pending you just need to send your contact information and the package is going to be delivered to your address uh, things on the line just to make you tempted saying okay i'm getting some money if i just fill in this form or if i just pass on my information i'm gonna get a parcel which is you know for me uh waiting somewhere which is all like uh, scams you don't you know you 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 need to be very 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 careful before you click on these links so let me get started and the one which we i'm gonna like you know talk about and show you the scam messages that i have been receiving is about the cr scams right so uh the, these are the messages that comes uh, claiming that the, the this is from cra and the best way of finding it out if it is actually from CRA or not um, first thing you go to the canada.ca which is the official website of uh, Canada and they have something called a CRA scam alert and they will clearly tell you that you need to be aware of um, uh, these alerts that they never like CRA will never message you with the link um, or will not ask you to enter your information uh, you, um, over the phone in a message or like and then send some examples that they have shown here so this is the example that shows um, you know how the message should look like uh, an example uh, of a scam message so this is uh, an example on the website and let's see what I've been receiving so the, here is a message that um, uh, I'm gonna be using that as an example here so I have been receiving multiple like multiple messages from different numbers I keep blocking them and I um, then I'll get a message from some new new number so uh this message says the the canada revenue agency cra sent you one-time grocery rebate payment to receive your payment click here and it gives me a link be very 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 careful if you receive something like this any any such message with a link wherein when you click on the link it will ask you to enter your contact information it's a scam don't ever uh, fall for this and if you want like i'll show you the number of messages that i have been receiving so if you look at it the last message i received was on 30th may and then uh, before that on 25th may it again says grocery and these guys are smart these guys are not stupid people to be honest these guys are smart if you know if you uh you know if you're in canada that you know that uh cra offered to you know give us uh, some uh grocery rebates um back to the taxpayers people who are in canada under you know who falls under the low income or the medium income families uh families with the kids or individuals uh cra offered to um you know uh, pay some uh grocery rebate but CRA is not going to send an e-transfer, okay? Um, they will have your account information when you apply for your taxes and your tax return comes to your account. Uh, your bank account information uh, will be there with CRA and you do not have to give them again. You do not have to click on any of these links. If you ever get to see some uh, messages coming your way, for example, like these, which says, Pending trans pending e transfer transaction, CRA tax credit has um, has sent to you three seventy point uh, forty five to deposit. Please click uh, the link provided, and it gives me the link. Uh, let me open this up for you. I call TRA. I asked them. I've been res I have been getting these messages. I assume that these are um, all like you know uh, fake uh, scam messages, and they 
they were like yeah it is scam good that you haven't uh, disclosed any of your information so if you if you look at it um what to do if you experience a cra scam or fra fraud it's on the uh, canada.ca page it will tell you that you have to report it to the police if you end up like uh, disclosing in your uh, disclosing your information so it will clearly tell you that cra uh, will not ask you for your sin number will not ask you for your bank account number or passport number so just be very careful um, and you can call these numbers if you're unsure and want to confirm the cra contacted you these are the numbers that you can call i'm not saying cra will never contact you cra uh, might contact you if there's a you know if you owe them something they might give you a call um they will ask you to verify your information and all that but you need to first identify whether it's actual cra employee calling you and how do you do that you need to like uh, take their name where, where exactly they're calling from the location and they uh, then you can ask them that um i would like to identify um you know i i would like to know uh if i'm talking to the right person or i'm being scammed so i'm not going to disclose my information give me a number to call back and i'll give you a call back so you can take the number for a call back and then you call cra these numbers give the name and the department he or she says that calling from and the location these guys will be able to verify if it is a genuine call or not okay very 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 important don't fall for these scams and uh, that's about it in this video probably in the next video i'm going to talk about like um uh, the actual cra um grocery rebate that they um uh, they have um they have been rolling out uh, who will receive it and what amount you can expect so that's something that probably uh, is going to be useful again so hopefully i'm going to be making a video making a video on that and for now uh, i wish you good luck have a good day and take care bye bye